All right, I'm gonna do this video here for you so you can see how to replace your ballast and your cables or your igniter cable for your Acura TL. Mine is a 2004, so um, basically to change this ballast, you just got three Phillips head screws that goes in here. And you just unscrew those. And it looks like it has a, like a little heat shield on top of it. You just take that off as well because it comes off with the uh, with the ballast. You are going to need one special tool for this. It's going to be the uh, tamper-proof T20 Torx head screw drive. Um, I'll show you that in a second here. So basically, you got your three screws here, and then the heat shield. It's got an R on it for the right side. And you got your ballast here, which just slides right off. But it won't come off yet because it's still connected to the light bulb, which is inside this tamper-proof housing here. So the T, the T20 is a. Uh, you can see it's got the little divot in it because the screw that has that has been placed on this has got a little nipple inside of it. And I know you can't see it with this little iPhone video that I'm doing. But that just goes in there and you just you just unscrew it like that take the screw out then you turn this righty tidy lefty loosey pull this out that's that that protects your igniter cable and the light bulb and basically you just take this igniter cable slide it off Disconnect the ground and all of this. Then this will slide out like that. Now on the original one, you're gonna need to save your uh, gasket here for the water. Make sure there's no water that gets inside there. And then this little rubber housing will pull up, which will get you to the, uh, the little clip that clips it in. Pull that off. And now you have this. And don't forget to save this. Take this off because that will go on your new one. This is trash. This is the bad one. My right side one is the bad one. So that will go in there. And you'll take this and fish it out. <clears throat> I don't know if this is good or bad, but either way, it's trash. Um, my new one is here. It's all shiny. And I will just take this and do the same thing. I'll unplug this. And before I do that, I will put the gasket on the new one. Then I'll fish this back down in here. That. Grab my ballast and plug it back in until it clicks. Seat the gasket back on there. Just hold it there until you get everything put back in place. Alright, I got that seated. I'm going to plug the ground back on. Don't forget to plug that in. Like that. Put this cover back on. Put the screw back in. Shield back on top of this. Put 
seated in there and put the three Phillips head screws back on and that's pretty much it once you tighten this up it's ready to put back in the car and hopefully these puppies work because I've been having troubles with my lights blowing or my right side headlight blowing out so I looked it up on the Acura's website well there's a uh, like a little message board and people always say that it's either the ballast or the igniter cable because I highly doubt that I'm getting lemon light bulbs all the time so hopefully this fixes it all right and that's what it looks like mm -hmm. Boom. all right I'll get back to doing my installation so you guys can check it out thanks for watching hope that helps